This is Car Guys New England, your YouTube channel for anything automotive. So it's Saturday, August 27th, and uh, I got some help here, Cyrus. Thank you very much for helping me, buddy. Thank you. I appreciate you doing a good job on the uh, the white walls, getting that blue gunk off. Yeah, look how much I did it. Yeah, you did a good job. But uh, yeah, let's keep going on this, and uh, then I got to get the car over to the gas station, put some gas in it. All right. So the white walls are clean on the driver's side. We'll finish up the uh, passenger side and then I'm gonna go take it to get some gas. And the passenger front is almost all set. Well, she's all clean, looking good. One thing that I need to check is my brake fluid, which looks like I can add a little, so I'm going to do that right now. All right, so it's a little low. I'll just add some. Not a big deal. We're good. All right, so we got that sealed up and uh, put the brake fluid away. All right, guys, so it's Friday uh, morning, uh, September 2nd, 2022, approximately uh, 6 10 a.m. Uh, the sun hasn't even risen yet, but I need to get to Connecticut uh, to pick up my lower control arms for the Caprice, so let's go for a ride. So we're only two days into September and it's already 47 degrees Fahrenheit in the morning. So I'm really rapidly running out of time to get the car together. Uh, technically, I have uh, about three weeks to get the car together and uh, do the house call. I've selected a date. Uh, it seems like a good date to do it. So hopefully the weather cooperates on that date and, uh, you know, We'll uh, get that done. Uh, but on another note, heading to Hartford, Connecticut, and uh, hopefully the uh, the Chrome turns out beautiful. Uh, they're one of the two Chrome shops in New England, so we'll uh, we'll see how that goes. I had to go pick up this stuff early uh, because it's Labor Day weekend, and they're not open on Saturday for pickup which meant I had to leave the house really early. Uh, hopefully I can be there when they open around eight-ish um, down in Connecticut. Hopefully there's no traffic uh, and then I can get my ass back to my office and take care of business that I need to take care of. So it's kind of an emergency so I can pick it up. It actually saves me a little bit of time. And we're in Connecticut. <laughs> Still got about 38 miles to go. All right, so we just picked up the uh, Chrome A arms. I'll check them out later when I get home in more detail and show you guys. But uh, now I got to get back up north. 
So I just got back from Connecticut, and uh, it's roughly uh, around 11 a.m. So got the A-arms. I haven't even opened them yet. I'll open them up later on this evening. Check them out. Um, you know, hopefully they look great. And uh, I'll start getting these on the car soon. All right, so it's the moment of truth. I've been waiting all day to do this, which would be just to open up and check out these uh, A-arms that I extended. Now, I only paid about $300 for each lower. I told them where to focus on it. So basically I only wanted them to focus on the outside edges. Uh, looks really good there. Ooh, yeah, edges are nice. Bottoms are nice. Ooh, those came out really good. I'm happy. All right, let's open up this other one. I'm sure it's gonna gonna look good as well. Oh yeah, yeah these uh, these are primo. They're nice. They came out excellent. Very happy with this. Can't beat the price. And uh, chrome looks spectacular on these, so it's great. Yeah, even the uh, the bottoms are pretty mint. Looking at it, nice finish on there. Not bad for 300 a piece and local. So it's Sunday, September 5th, Labor Day. And uh, I gotta get the Caprice over to Ken's Auto. It's raining and just another thing to hold me up a little bit. As you can see, my wipers are trash, so I need to go to the parts store, get new wipers, put those on the car, and then uh, we'll get over to Ken's. All right, wipers are off. I'm gonna bring one with me to the parts store, and uh, hopefully they're easy to change out ones that I get, because these absolutely suck to get off. All right, so I got my new Bosch wiper blades. I'm gonna put those on, and uh, then I'm gonna head out. All right, there's one Bosch, it's on. Let's get the other one on. Well, here we go. Time to drive it in the rain to Ken's back roads. Oh, here we go, new wipers, new wipers. Oh, yes, looks good. And we're finally getting into Bill Ricca. Took back roads all the way down here. All right, we got the Caprice here at Ken's Auto. And uh, we're gonna work on his Regal for a little bit. Get the body mounts in. We've already started. So it's looking good. Polyurethane. Lined up pretty good, too. It did line up pretty good. Yep. How does this thing have? Nine eights. Cut that. There's no need to mess with that. Yep. Oh, I just don't know if I could take like the alternator out to get that line out or. So what's that in the back? Is that like back, a heat, heat, the main heat. vacuum line? Ah. Uh, this isn't gonna be on that good. Nope. The number one best thing about getting rid of carbur carburetors, go fuel injected, is less vacuum. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's vacuum, vacuum, vacuum. 
for, you know, obviously reasons, but when it's infection starts to feel this pain now. Some museum probably wants it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it looks clean. That you are, you know, like you say, you know, but you bought your car because, you know. So we need to switch over the uh, cruise control, also the stud, put that on there. Um, so the secondary vacuum is in a different spot, but that, that'll still work with this, this carb. Uh, everything else is pretty much the same, so. Too bad, you finally got rid of his truck. I know. I think the time we all we went that time it was Labor Day weekend too, I think. It was, wasn't that busy either. Yeah, well I'm at that point now. He he got they leak because they only have four bolts holding it yeah it's pretty stupid well, that's why they changed it over in 87 of the center bolt uh, valve covers See the roof is just shit. It's water getting in, it's raining out, whatever. But uh, got the carburetor in, it's running good. And we're back home in the garage, and uh, this is looking a hell of a lot better. I got a chance to clean up the chrome uh, 
wheel wells, uh, put the new valve cover, valve covers on, new air cleaner, and the new carburetors on, obviously. So, uh, you know, this is uh, definitely looking good. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give the video a like. If you have questions or comments, be sure to comment down below. This is Jay with Car Guys New England. Until next time, take care.